What's up guys, 12 v 15 squad builder, and today we're going to Ronaldinho hybrid, and it's actually really difficult to get Ronaldinho into a team on full chemistry, and uh, that actually wins game. Obviously, you can do like a full Brazil team, that'd be quite easy, but this is a nice hybrid with some really good players. The first player is Joe Hart, the number one England goalkeeper. Got some really nice stats on his card, a bit of a shame he did get downgraded, but nevertheless, he still does a very good job in this team. Next up in the team, we do have Mangala from Manchester City, 76 pace, 79 defending and 85 physical, and make him a very good centre-back on this game. I think he's about 7,000 coins at the moment, so a pretty good price for some very good stats on his card. Next up in the team, we do have another Manchester centre-back, but it is from Manchester United this time. And it is Rojo, who's got very similar stats. He's got like three less physical and one less pace. But apart from that, they are very similar in stature. And uh, generally, they do a very good job too. Uh, very good centre-backs with over 75 pace. And uh, yeah, pretty good defensive in this team. Next up in the team, we do have a Brazilian. And it is Rafael from Manchester United. He has got some pretty good stats this year. 83 pace, 77 dribbling, 77 physical and 76 defending and he's pretty much discard value so a pretty decent price for a very good player next up in the left back position we do have Luke Shaw and um, it is kind of nice that he has a gold this season unfortunately he got a pace downgrade for some reason I'm not too sure why because he is absolutely rapid in real life and uh, maybe because at the start of the season he had a bit of a fitness issue but nevertheless he still does a very good job in this team going down that left hand side and crossing the ball into the box Next up in the team, we do have a CDM, and he is from Chelsea, and it is Ramirez, the absolute beast. 88 pace on a CDM is ridiculous. He is quite expensive at the moment. I think he's about 30,000 coins. So if you want to get a cheap alternative, you can always use Paulinho, but Ramirez is a really good, crucial part of this team, and if you've got the coins, obviously go out and try and get him. Next up in the team, we do have the main man in this team, and that is Ronaldinho, of course, the absolute legend. Getting that uh, orange link into Raphael and... Uh, it is really difficult to get him into teams, but this team did pretty well, and of course, with his 85 passing and 85 dribbling, he has got 72 strength as well, so in this like deeper centre mid role, he still does some quite good defensive jobs. Next up in the team, we do have Camelo, basically the chemistry user. He's uh, Ronaldinho's bitch for chemistry this year. He just got that strong link with him, of course, and he's got some pretty good stats. Of course, he's got four star skills, 78 pace, 78 dribbling, and 72 shot. Next up in the team, we do have a silver, unfortunately. He's probably the worst player in this team. He has got a bit of a pace to him, but he's mainly for chemistry reasons. And uh, yeah, he's okay. 83 uh, pace, 70 dribbling, and 70 physical. Some okay rounded stats, but if you could improve one position in that team, it probably would be that right hand side. Next up in the team, we do have Yanazai from Manchester United. He is a gold this year. I don't know if he should really be a gold. He hasn't played that many games, but he has got. A bit of potential to him, of course. 82 pace, 81 dribbling, 4-star skills and 4-star weak foot. The same weak foot as Ronaldo. So, I think that's a little bit silly because I think Ronaldo is a lot better with his weak foot than Yanazai. But nevertheless, we're going to go into the final player in this team. And he is a 75 rated striker. And it is Pabon. He is quite short, but he's got quite good physical for saying he's only 5 foot 6, 87 pace, 78 shot and 76 dribbling. 4-star skills as well. So, yeah, pretty good play in this team, or is it three star? I'm not too sure off the top of my head. But nevertheless, if you want to get Ronaldinho into a team that you can win games with quite nicely, this is probably one of them. If you want to link me as well on Twitter, any other teams, I'll be more than willing to build them because I really like Ronaldinho on this game and uh, I want to try him out a lot more. So, yeah, link us some squads, leave a like, subscribe if you're on your channel, and see you soon. Bye.